whatever it is she's getting from you it is not as readily available as whatever she gets from other guys you will always be a desirable guy and the more desirable you become the more she wants to give it to you yo what's up inspired alphas welcome back to another video today we are talking about why if she respects you she is going to give you the box she is willing to give up the box if she respects you if you are new to the channel welcome feel at home make sure you like make sure you subscribe let's jump into it number 1 if she can't play you then she plays with you guys think about it you see when i was a, when i was a kid well i used to observe how women how the, the the girls that were in my school how they used to behave with other boys you see the guy the, the boys that were mean and they never really were interested in these women these are the the guys that these women were wanted to play with in fact everywhere you even even right now i can see my small brother he's usually disinterested in people and you know he's, he just wants to play with by himself and you see the way other other children respond to that they want to play with him but he pushes them away and this is the same same reaction when a guy uh, when a woman respects a man when when you respect yourself enough then you are not seeking any validation which is the mistake i used to do i used to seek validation from women because well hmm, i had my own issues but the point is that they never respected me and when women don't respect you then they are going to play you, you they might give you attention but they are, it, it has an angle they are giving you attention in order to get something from you it's manipulative but when she respects you when she actually respects you she wants to play with you by play i mean the childish play the way you see children playing around without even thinking about anything that is what is going to happen and well we we, we are we are big we are big guys and we know what when you are playing with a chick what it means when she wants to play with you we all know what that means so guys this put this in your mind put this in your mind it is better to be the guy that she fears but respects rather than be the guy that she is comfortable with but never respects you because it is in that fear or it is in that tension awkwardness that attraction is 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 sparked if she never i'm telling you guys think about your think about your interactions with women if there is never a, a small tension there then you are just average you are just like her you are just basic friends there is nothing there this is something that i i have observed with most of the chicks that i am dealing with it, uh, even if we are not dating or anything there is that tension there is always that tension because well she can't trust herself enough to be well she can't be comfortable with me to that point because she knows where it, it, it will it might lead it might lead to either a heartbreak or rejection or a business meeting so guys when she respects you she will play with you this is a guarantee number 2 number 2 you become more desirable you see right now we are living in a world where simping is the norm simping is the norm you might think that there are there are a lot of guys on self improvement but in reality in reality guys who are improving themselves are less than 10% of the world population imagine 90% of men are simps and better males and men who just don't understand how female nature works so just like the way we used to do i i am guilty of 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 being a guy who uh tried to please women 
I was a people pleaser. Always trying to be the good guy, always trying to, you know, be the savior. But in reality, all I was doing is just simping. And the reality is that I was never a desirable guy. Yeah, you might say I was cute or handsome, but all these things, they are not valuable or they don't have that worth if she doesn't respect you because it is not that attractive. You see, what, what creates attraction is the scarcity. And when women can't get their way with you, then, you know, whatever it is they are used to getting, they are not getting it from you. So it becomes scarce. So she will always be trying to get it from you because it is a scarce resource. It is something that has value. So as long as, as long as whatever it is she's getting from you, it is not as readily available as whatever she gets from other guys. You will always be a desirable guy. And the more desirable you become, the more she wants to give it to you. Because, you see, uh, women use it as a tactic. Women use the box as a tactic because it's the only source of power that they have. So, if, she, if it's not working, you see, she might start dangling it into your eyes. And other guys, just by the thought of getting laid, the thought of getting laid gets, confuses them. So if she can't confuse you, then the only probable solution that's, that she can try that maybe might work is giving it to you. And once she gives it to you, she has no leverage. She has no leverage. So guys, remember... Remember, if she respects you, I'm telling you 100%, she might try everything in her power to get, to get to you, to give it to you. So don't be the guy who, 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 who gets confused by just, you know, the thought of a woman giving you the boot or the coach. Come on. Because it is in abundance. It is in abundance. That is if you have that abundance mindset, if you respect yourself enough. Number three. Number three, when she respects you, it means that she views you as a leader. And when you lead, she follows. You see, one thing that I, I have learned so far, that is, we, well, I, I am a head of a small community-based organization. And the way the, it has given me status in the society so i am usually a big deal i am a, 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 and well the point is that when you are a leader then people follow you people follow your instructions and you see it translates itself from that role even into your life where you are always in that leadership mode so, you lead her, she follows. If you find her attractive, when you kiss her, then you are leading, you are escalating, you are telling her, this is what I want. Or, you know, when you tell her, let's go out. Or when you tell her, whatever, whatever it is you want her to do. She's going to do it because she respects you. Meaning, if she respects you, she views you as a leader. And she has to follow. So guys, I'm telling you, if she respects you 100%, it is so easy. It is so easy. I don't understand why guys complain that getting laid is so hard. It is easy, but it starts with you respecting yourself. The moment I started respecting myself, the, that is when everything changed. That is when everything changed. Last but not the least. Last but not the least is that respect comes from taking risks doing the things that other people find hard or are not willing to do. Just like going to the gym earns you respect because it's hard. This is the same same way. The way we respect guys who have a lot of money. And not just the money from inheritance, 
but a guy who has worked his ass off from maybe having so much debt to being a billionaire how how do you think that guy is treated with so much respect because you do the things that are hard so you when you take more risks you become a guy who is a risky guy well let me call it risky because even when you are dealing with women you take risks and by taking risks you might take a risk and say i am not going to deal with you because i i am taking a risk of leaving you alone and going to find someone better who is not going to give me headaches so when you do that i'm telling you guys when you are a guy who takes risks you are not afraid of the losses because you know that you are going to learn regardless then 100% women res- women will respect you regardless of whatever people tell you or regardless whether you win or lose the fact that you are a risk taker that enough earns you respect and so she does not want to play games with a guy who takes risks because sh- this guy can live it is the guys who are afraid to take risks that stick around that are in their comfort zones they never want to live or they stick in a toxic relationship because they don't want to go through the pain of loss which is inevitable so learn to take risks learn to take risks you will get respected and all these things will be so easy for you anyway hopefully you got value from today's video make sure you like make sure you subscribe see you in the next video peace out